Hey dear, I hope all of you are doing great, amazing and fine. This session is very important because most of the students are saying that Aditi, I want to work with the Microsoft. Okay, so if your goal is to work with the Microsoft, then this video is for you. Okay, like you have upgraded your skills and you are expert in any department. Okay, you can have your own expertise, you can have your own academic background, you can have your own experience. And if you are willing to work with Microsoft in your own domain, then this video is for you. Okay, because in this video, Video, I will guide you step by step and step roadmap that how you can apply for the Microsoft, what is the career portal of the Microsoft and uh, what is the step needs to be followed and everything. Okay. So make sure that you watch this video till the end and uh, whatever I will say practically executed from your end and I I would be really, really happy if you will be the next one to work with the Microsoft. Okay, so yeah, many of the students are applying directly through the references and the LinkedIn's and directly uploading the resumes in the third party portals. Please don't do that. Okay, if you want to work with the Microsoft, then you can directly apply from their own career related website. Okay, so now if you want to apply for the Microsoft, you need to just go to Google and search Microsoft careers. Okay, and hit enter. If you search for Microsoft careers, you will see first website, which is careers.microsoft.com. Okay, so this is the website only which can help you to find out what are the openings and jobs available. This will the this is the website will help you to apply for the jobs, uh, will help you to know a complete requirement and the responsibilities of the job and the location as well. Okay, so make sure that Please don't apply from any random website or a Shine or a Indeed or a LinkedIn if you want to work with a Microsoft because they have created their own platform and they don't like that if you apply from the third party websites. Okay, if you want to be the first one that okay they check your resume they check uh, you know the portfolio you created uh, they give you the interview call if you want to be the first one to to you know be in the eye of the recruiter of the microsoft then you need to must apply from the career portal of the microsoft itself okay so go to the google search for microsoft careers and you will come to this website which is careers.microsoft.com okay so let's explore this particular website in this website we have the option of location this is a very important option because if you want to work abroad, if you want to work within India and within India as well, they have few centers. So you need to first of all check out that from which center they have which location. Okay. And the opening. So in the location section of the Microsoft, you will see that all the openings, which is in the Asia specific region. And uh, in Asia specific, they have three centers, Singapore, Sydney, and Tokyo. Then we have a Europe. Okay. So in Europe, they have multiple center in Amsterdam, in Dublin, in Estonia, Greece, Munich, Norway, Paris, and so on in Prague as well. So in, you know, Europe, they have all these particular center in greater China region. They have centers in Hong Kong, Shanghai, and a lot of multiple regions in India. They have multiple centers in Bangalore, Hyderabad, Gurgaon, Mumbai, Noida. In Latin America, they have centers in, uh, you know, Mexico and so on in Middle East and Africa, Dubai, uh, Istanbul, and so on in North America, Seattle, uh, Bay Area, New Zealand, New England, New York york and so on okay so you need to first of all see that where they have offices you know where uh, is the location and accordingly then you can apply for the jobs that is very important like first of all you need to make your mindset clear you know you can't able to apply for the job any opening that you can see on the random portal not at all if you are dedicated in if your goal is clear that yes aditi i am willing to work with microsoft if your answer is yes in that case this is a website the career portal will help you and first of all you need to go in the locations of the portal okay in location you will see multiple regions let's say if you want to work within the india itself and let's say if you want to work in noida okay so you need to hit noida and you need to check out that how many openings we have in the noida 
so you can see that look inside microsoft so you can see a complete noida uh, you know office as well a complete setup and you can see explore career opportunities so they update this particular portal every day and you can see that principal software engineer this post is one day ago itself software engineer one day ago they post this opening in their career portal you know इतनी फास्ट तो कहीं पर भी नहीं आती शाइन इंडीड लिंकड इन इतनी फास्ट ओपनिंग्स आपको कहीं पर नहीं दिखेगी जितनी आपको माइक्रोसॉफ्ट करियर पोर्टल पे दिखेगी ओके सो दैट्स व्हाई आई एम सेइंग इफ यू आर विलिंग टू वर्क विद माइक्रोसॉफ्ट मेक श्योर दैट यू गो टू देयर करियर पोर्टल सेलेक्ट द लोकेशन सेलेक्ट द ऑफिस सेंटर एंड देन चेक आउट द करियर अपॉर्चुनिटीज इन देयर okay in that particular area in that particular office so in the noida office we have 72 openings and maybe if you will watch the video some other day the numbers can change so as you can see that 86 openings it is showing and you can search by the help of keyword as well so these are the opening principal software engineer and architect software engineer senior engineer and software and so on let's say if you want to work as a an analyst so just search analyst and let's see if we get any openings in here okay so we have multiple openings in the analyst and you see that dv engineer and so on so analyst can't be the proper profile in the engineering because they have a lot of openings for software engineer so as a software engineer maybe you need to work on some data tools and technologies that is absolutely possible so please don't go with just a job profile or a job name please check out the job roles and responsibilities as well okay maybe you feel like okay i don't know software i don't know engineering i i'm not from coding or a programming can i apply for this job first of all please check the complete job roles and responsibilities okay let's say if you want to apply for this job you can see a complete overview okay you can see the complete responsibilities as well see all these are the responsibilities in here okay so you can see the responsibilities and if you feel like that you are qualified enough for this job you can apply for this job okay this is all the qualification and a microsoft and these all are the similar jobs we have in here okay so if you are willing to apply for this job you can create or you can just click on apply now if you click on apply uh, apply now you can sign in with the google as well you can use any of your email id you can sign in with google okay i will use my google id in here and you can directly apply for this particular position okay just click on continue in here and uh, we don't recognize okay so we need to create a account this all are the sign in option if you want you can create a account in here you need to write the country i will just write india okay and uh, yes allow i will say yes for this as well and click on submit okay now as soon as you select the country um it will process a bit and now let me just and if you are already a microsoft employee you can sign in here okay you have an account now i can sign in so i'll click on this i'll use a same google account i'll hit continue okay it will take few minutes to refresh and now i am successfully signed in in the microsoft career portal okay and if you want you can you know create your profile with existing information you can directly upload your resume here or you can manually enter your details okay so did you know uh, linkedin can generate a resume for you that's absolutely we all know that through linkedin we can generate our own resume so as of now if you're applying for a microsoft career portal you can upload your resume from the system itself okay so i will check out my resume here okay so i am here dr aditi gupta resume i'll click on open so here we can directly upload a resume because you know if you upload a resume on the microsoft website and they you know their system constantly check or screen the resume and if they feel like okay you are the best fit for any of the position or any of the opening they can directly mail you okay because i have logged in in the microsoft career portal using my 
you know own email id my professional google email id and i want you to use a gmail id itself because you will get a lot of recommendations new job openings all the notifications in your gmail itself and that will be very beneficial for you okay so here is my first name my number it automatically fetch everything from my you know resume i'll click on submit okay great as soon as i click on submit it will upload my details in the microsoft career portal and i have clicked on software engineering like i want to apply for this job so i can you know i need to now write all the details like resume or contact information candidate questions job specific questions and so on and then you can submit your application okay so whatever the jobs you feel like whatever the jobs you are interested in you can directly submit the application related to that okay so this is a this is the process this is the actual process that you need to follow if you want to directly apply for the microsoft career portal or the microsoft application okay because you i I really don't want you to use a third party application or please don't pay anyone that give me the reference and please help me to go for the interview give us the interview call and so on everything is scam out there okay make sure that you do a real effort okay go to the career portal apply for the specific job check out the job roles and responsibilities and let's say if I, if i am applying for the software engineering position so i will check the job roles and responsibilities and accordingly that i will tailor my resume okay as of now i am a power bi expert so my resume is full of my power bi capabilities but i can see that this job role and responsibilities want something else okay so that's why i need to change something in my resume as well i can't use same resume to apply for all the job openings which you can see on the microsoft portal we can't do that okay so make sure that if you are applying for any of the job opening check out the roles and responsibilities tailor your resume accordingly and submit the application okay and please we have a lot of softwares now like chat gpt a lot of ai softwares they can help you to tailor your resume they can help you to build a resume and everything you can automate and everything is easy but as far as your career is concerned you need to manually apply for these job roles no ai or nothing can help you with the same okay nowadays everyone is saying that ai can do this or that or this or that but no if you if you are a human being then in the companies we need humans to work okay and for that you need to apply manually to these applications and the microsoft career portals like this okay so please take this very seriously and at least apply you know most of the people are like aditi the interview round will be very difficult aditi i am not qualified enough will i able to get a job aditi what will be the process and if you are like if you feel like no aditi i am not made for mnc i am good with the company that i am working with and you want you are just working as a ordinary professional please don't do that okay because at least you can try i am not saying ki aap iske liye apply karoge to aapko for sure job mil hi jayegi i am not saying that but i am saying at least you can try okay try it out maybe maybe the god is there maybe your maybe because of the capabilities that you have the journey that you have been through the talent you have maybe you can able to get into the microsoft as well it is not a very hard or impossible task to do okay so make sure that you check out this microsoft career portal you check out the job openings as far as the locations you are interested in and apply for the job first of all tailor your resume accordingly okay don't use the same resume for all the job openings tailor your resume accordingly by seeing the job roles and responsibilities for that chatgpt will help you just give it a, give us give them a prompt and that's it okay and that's how you can apply for the microsoft job openings and please use this particular website because here we have a locations here we have a professions like accordingly as far as your profession is concerned you can apply for this job like you want to apply for administrative role you want to apply for analytics role business development role business operations and so on so we have a multiple professions we have a multiple programs in microsoft like if you are early in profession okay so you can 
you know find out the job openings here if you are early in profession that means you are first time applying for the microsoft or if you want to apply as a fresher or as an intern this will help you for sure if you come from a military background then you have a specific job roles for the military people in here okay microsoft have this own initiative like most of the people want to transform their career from the arms armed forces and from the military services as well so for them they have a separate job openings okay so you have the opportunity in early in profession military and neurodiversity okay life at microsoft you can check hiring tips you can check okay so that's why i'm saying that this is the only portal that you need to use for applying in the microsoft and let's say if you want to apply for a singapore or a sydney you know sydney is in australia so if you want to apply for a sydney job roles you can see that we have 80 plus openings in sydney okay and then you can check it out because guys i know you know uh it will take a lot of efforts it will take a lot of dedication and a discipline from your end but i am really sure and i'm very sure if you dedicatedly apply for this job role as far as the talent and the expertise you have you can directly and you can definitely work with the microsoft okay you can work within india but it is a very very good platform will give you the exposure chances as well if you want to work with abroad you can work you know with the microsoft and that's how you can apply for these companies okay i hope this video is really meaningful and helpful for you all this video is just to motivate you just to guide you that you can apply for these jobs as well you can apply for the google and a microsoft and these mncs as well okay if you're already working if you have a very good years of experience now if you want to uh, you know get a good working environment good package then this is a portal will help you for sure okay at least try hoga nahi hoga dekha jayega at least try okay so uh, if you are willing to work then you can of course use this particular website and if you want ki i will make a lot of more videos related to a multiple more companies and how you can apply for these jobs as well uh, you can comment uh, like you can let me know that aditi make the next video for this company and how i can apply for this company job roles and so on so you can comment on this particular video if you want to make if you want me to make an another video related to the same job openings and the you know career portals and the resume building as well not only this guys let's say if you want to work with the microsoft you need to have a proper skills with you okay so if you want to upgrade your skills then you can join my next workshop as well i will put the link in the description where i will guide you more about upgrading the skills and applying for the jobs like this okay so that's about uh, for today's session and i'll see you in the next one until then bye bye have fun please take care